Yeah, uh, if you ever say yes uh, like that, they'll probably think you're having a stroke. Eh. <laughs> hey there, everybody. This is Evan Rogers coming at you with an online easy, or what's it called, online lesson with Evan's Easy Japanese. We're on lesson six, e-adjectives. Uh, however, this is like the almost the 50th lesson altogether in the playlist that you've clicked to get here most likely uh, You can join in too, five bucks a month Also, there's links to ways you can support me if you are at all interested in doing so One buck a month on patreon gets you access to all the materials that I've made. This will be added eventually We're here with John and Kayla. You guys ready to go? Hit it. Great. That's your favorite phrase. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. He just likes hitting things. Number seven. Thank goodness. Great. We're Tony the Tiger today. All right. Please repeat after me. Kaimashtaka. 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 And we're not really sure exactly what the uh, what the what the uh, what the subject is, but most likely it's did you buy it or maybe did he buy it or did she buy it. Eh, kaimashita. Yeah, oh, that's great. So notice it's past tense. This is almost a set phrase that just means, oh, that's good, that's good. Hey, did you buy it? Yeah, I bought it. It was delicious. Oh, that's good. It was great. It was tasty. It was delicious. That's what Oishi is good in the sense of t flavor town. All right. Any questions there? No. <laughs> All right. Great. Dekimashtaka. 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 Yeah. Dekimashtaka. Dekimashtaka. Uh, notice how dekimas means to be able to do, uh, but were you able to do it translates to did you finish it? Were you able to do it? Did you get it? Eh, dekimashita. Eh, You're missing a K. Oh, hey, nice catch. Eh, dakimashita. Omoshiro kata desu. Omoshiro kata desu. Yo kata desu. Yo kata desu. Yo kata desu. Oh, yo kata desu ne. Yo kata desu ne. Um, it's almost bad for me, but I'm kind of glad you're not learning hiragana katakana so that I can have you proofreading my romaji. <laughs> all right. I'm all over. <laughs> He's like, I'm a hollow. <laughs> all right. So the verb in 1B changes with the verb that comes in 1A. And then 1B or B says uh, some sort of description of how they felt about whatever it was they did. Okay. Yes. Great. Awesome. Were you able to do it? I was able to do it. Here we go. Eat. Did you eat it? Yeah. It was amakata. What does amai mean? Am amakata. Good. Huh? Uh, like, tasty? Close. It's what kind of sweet cherry pie? Sweet. My, yeah, exactly, my sweet cherry pie. I think that's a Weird Al Yankovic song. Drum solo. All right. Uh, so, Tabimasta Amakata. Did you eat it? It was sweet. Go ahead, Kayla. You'll be number one. You're always number one in my book, Kayla. <laughs> Tabe Mashtaka. Eh, Uh, Amakata des. Yokata des. Yeah, uh, if you ever say yes uh, like that, they'll probably think you're having a stroke. Eh. <laughs> oh, me? Yeah, yeah. Eh. Eh. Tabe Mashta. One more time. Tabe uh Mashta. -huh. Yeah, uh, eh. Tabe Mashta. Eh, Tabe Mashta. Okay, great, great. I'm gonna cut to this. All right, so John, we are going to ask her if she ikimashtad, and then she's gonna reply that she did, and it was chikakata. What does ikimas mean? Like, isn't that like, did you go? Yeah, did you go to whatever location it is we're talking about? We'll learn how to say specific places that we go to later. And what does chikakata mean? Um. Or Chikai. Near? Yeah, nearby, exactly. So, John, did you go? Kayla, it was nearby. Uh, Ikimashita. Exactly. Eh, eh, Ikimashita. 
Chikata desu. Chikata. There's two cars there. Chikata desu. My bad. Chikata desu. Yokata desu. Yo, yokata desu. Yokata desu. Ne. Yokata desu. Ah, yokata desu. Ah, yokata desu. Something like that. Like a side relief that it was so nearby. All right. Hopefully, remember. We remember the pattern, and I enunciate properly. Mimashita. Yes, I mimashita, and it was hayakata. What does mimas mean, and what does hayai mean? One of two answers for hayai is accurate. Uh, mimashita is like to to see. Yeah, did you or see it? Saw? Yeah. Uh, oh man, I don't remember what haya haya hayai. Hayai desu ne. Mm. No. I remember. No. Well, John, you did so well when we were, when we were doing the vocab cards. Maybe you you remember. Uh, I'm, I want K a little later. <laughs> this so. one. This one means quick. quick. Or fast. Hey, uh, I it, don't know if get that one down. Well, this hayai down here means early. This one means fast. So hey, did you see that? Yeah, it was quick. All right, okay. Kayla, go ahead and ask John if he saw that. Mimashita uh, eh, Hayakata. Oh, no. I, eh, Yeah, without the question in tradition. Hayakata des. Hayakata des. Yeah. And then it's Yokata des? Yokata des? Yokata des? Was it all right? Yokata des. Yeah, exactly. Like... <laughs> it's okay. J just go for the gusto. <laughs> All right. Next we have tsukurimashita and we have yasukata. Tsukurimas and yasui. What do they mean? <laughs> well, don't everybody speak up at once. Do we know yasui? <laughs> Sukurimasu, that's a... You're going to say use, but it's not use, it's... Oh, man, you knew I was going to say it. <laughs> make. This one's to make something. Did you make it? Back and forth between the two. Yeah. If you make something on your own, usually you'll save a lot of money because it's so... Inexpensive. Or cheap, cheap, inexpensive. Yeah, exactly. So, John, you're going to ask if she made it herself. And, indeed, you did. It was cheap. Uh, sukurimashita. Uh, sukurimashita. Uh, it's just sukurimashita. One more time, okay. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Uh, sukurimashita. Do I say des? No, 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 no. There's no des after a uh, up, up, up verb. Sukurimashita. <laughs> yes, got a des. Great. <laughs> Sorry. Our son is, I found off the couch. What, who just fell off the couch? Our son. Oh, geez, is he okay? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I feel bad telling you what the next line is, but it's yokata desu. That's good. Yokata desu. Yeah, I'm, I'm not trying to say that I'm glad he fell off the, the, the couch, but... uh. <laughs> All right, next. Is he okay, though? He, he's okay? Yeah. Okay, okay. Next one, we have shimashita and hayakata. We already know what hayakata means. This one is early. What is shimas? <laughs> he whispered something. I don't know what he whispered, though. Yeah, he's whispering now. <laughs> <laughs> what is shimas? This is to do something, maybe to play a game. That's right. Yes, I remember that now. All right. Here we go. Kayla, you're asking him if he did it? John, yeah, he did. It was early. I did it early. Shimashita ka? Shimashita. Hayakata desu. Yeah, hayakata desu. Yokata desu. Yokata desu. Ah, yokata desu. All right, we have yomimashita. Mijikata. Oh, this is a typo. Miji. Ka kata. There we go. Miji ka kata. Ooh. Miji ka kata. So there's going to be two kakas there. Hee 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 hee. Okay. 
Because it's normally Miji Kai, and then the Kata. I must have just not hit the Ka a second time. Yomi Masta, Miji Kakata. Yomi Masta, what does Yomi Masta mean, and what does Miji Kai mean? Short. And read. Yeah, exactly. So did you read it? Yeah, it was short. Great. Uh, John, you're up. Uh, Yomi Masta Ka. Eh, Yomi Masta. Miji Kakata this. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Yokata does. <laughs> Yokata does. Great, perfect. <laughs> Mimastaka, and then we have Okikata. What is Mimasta and Oki? Uh, did you. Mimasta is like saw. Yep. And Okikata is like large. Yeah, it was big. Did you see it? Yeah, it was big. Kayla, did you see that? Is what you're going to ask John? And John, whatever it was, it was apparently big. Me master. Me master. Okay, kata des. Yo kata des. Yo kata des. Okay, kata des. Yeah. <laughs> All right, great. Any questions with that one? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh my goodness, is that the last one? Oh, I thought there was going to be more. That was it. You guys did well. If you enjoyed this video, I'd love it if you like, subscribe, and share this video to everybody you know and yell at them repeatedly until they subscribe as well. If you'd like to support me even more, head on over to Patreon.com, where for just $1 a month, three cents a day, that's it, it's darn near free, you can help me financially keep these videos coming. And as a reward for your Patreon donations, you get access to all of the miscellaneous things that I produce to help out my own students, who I teach in person, and also just things that I make for myself. And if you want a little bit more bang for your buck, head on over to Teespring, where you can get lots of fun clothing, mugs, stickers, cell phone cases, all that I've designed. More designs to come. I hope you have yourself a happy, happy day. Peace out.